Well, hello everybody and shout out from Alberta. Hope everyone's doing all right. Today we are gonna test the HP server power supply on 240 volt. But there was a comment, someone wanted to see my operation. I think it was Chan Coin. So like I said in the comments, it was small. So here I have uh, seven four gig, what are they, RX 570s, one four gig 580, three eight gig uh, 580s and one 8 gig 570 so 12 cards total that's what's sitting on this rig and we'll be using the six card rig here to test out that power supply and over here we got the 25700 XT the pulse and the nitro the 5600 XT running off a of PDU over around to my 30 amp 240 volt the volts with uh, the space goats meter so yeah that is what's going on in this little room. And in my other room, I'll run to right away here quick. Let's bolt. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Turn on the light. And in here is the gaming PC that is running a RTX 2060 KO and a 3900X uh, Ryzen CPU mining Monero at 14,600 hashes per second. And that GPU does about 33. So. That is my complete mining operation. I know it's small, but that's what I got. So I hope everybody can see everything all right. I do have my lights set up here. That's bright. One right there, one over there. Coming in here, as you can see. <laughs> so hopefully it cancels out shadows and all that because they're coming from both angles. But yeah, so first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to test uh, the system power with the PSUs there. And then I'm going to pull them off. Then we're going to throw on the HP power supply and then we're going to see what kind of power uses we're getting. And yeah, that will be the video. So let's try this. It'll take me probably a couple hours, but for you it should only be like a 10, 12 minute video, hopefully. So yeah, let's get into this and see what happens. Everything is currently shut down. All the cards are unplugged. All that's running is our system there. So we're going to take a look at our power consumption with the two PSUs. 26, 27. All right, let's roll with, we'll do 27 just to have it kind of in the middle. We are booted up. We are system idle in Hive OS, 55% fans. And we are pulling, what do we got here? So about 100, we'll go with what, 146 watts, I think. Seems to be closest to that point. So 146. Here we are mining now. These are my current settings. 1100 core, 5 DPM, 790. The one card needed 830 or just die on me. <laughs> with the rest all at 790. 2000 memory, 800 MDPM. And the reference is at 30. So let's take a look at our power down the line. Here we go. We're running. <laughs> and our power. I did my numbers based on 669 seems to be the middle. Let's have a look there. So yeah, I went with 669 for my number. Now we're just going to calculate all this right quick, which I already did. So here we are, we got 27 system idle, 146 watts idle with cards, brings us down to 119 watts, so 19.83 watts per card when you divide it by 6 on average. Mining, we're at 669 minus the 27, we're doing 642 watts on the 6 card rig at 177.2 mega hash, works out to 0.2760 uh, mega hash per watt which puts us at 107 watts per card on average so that's our numbers with the PSUs now I'm gonna hook up our HP server power supply to 240 and see what kind of numbers we get there so our power supply is plugged in but turned off and it is pulling 14.6 so 14.6 with it off now we'll turn it on there's our Christmas lights And now we're drawing 30.5 for 
So yeah, we'll go with 30, we'll go with 30.5. Get those two numbers down. Now I'll plug in the PSU and then we'll get a system without the cards and see what we're looking at. So now we're looking for our system idle. This is turned on, as you can see. We took the two PSU out, unplugged all the cards from the PCI's end here, and plugged in just the one PCU to run the CPU and everything. So we eliminated that PCU all com completely. Nothing's plugged in, all the PCI's are pulled out. That one's not even plugged in at all, so I don't have to worry about it. So the one PCU for the system and the HP server power supply, we are pulling. Let's go with 48 is point oh uh, forty eight point six forty eight point seven we're gonna go forty eight point seven we are now idling with the cards in hive os same thing fifty five percent fans and just in case some people were curious i seen it in other videos comments though but pci risers can go in the sixteen and the eight time slots that's the bigger ones as you can see right there they'll just fit in the front there so they do work. I've seen that question a couple times in multiple places. So just to clear that up. So we were idling at 172. What are we going to go with here? 172.7 at pause. So we'll do 172.7. I'll get it mining. Then we'll go over all our numbers. We are mining exact same settings. Pull on 177.5 mega hash now. It went up a slight bit. I did my numbers based on 0 0.3, so it won't really matter. <laughs> we'll take a look at our power consumption here. So we are running at 698.95. I based my numbers on 697, which seems to be in the middle. So we're going with 697 for our numbers. Now let's look at our comparison chart and what everything looks like so here we are so we had 48.7 watts was our system idle is 172.7 and mining we had 697 so we subtract our 48.7 system we are pulling 648.3 watts while mining which works out to uh, 177.3 mega hash at 0.2734 so that is our efficiency with these cards. And remember, on 1200 watt max, you can only run 960. That's the 80% rule. I might be different with these uh, power supplies. I'm not 100% sure. Let me know in the comments. But I think with electricity, you always follow that. So now we're going to do a comparison. So 0 0.2734 versus 0 0.2760. So not much of a difference there. We are averaging. Do I have my average card? I did not put the average card out. That was well. That oh crap. Okay, so I'm gonna do that right quick and take a look. 108.05 is our average card there. That it's on its power consumption versus 107. So 107, 108, and uh, I was noted that the more load you put on these power supplies, the more efficient they become. So we could bring that number down more if we added more cards, and there is plenty of room. We could probably fit, what are we at here total? 648, it's an average, so we could probably fit two more cards on this to be safe. So we could run six, seven, eight cards on this rig and be quite efficient. So now, is it worth using one of these power supplies? I would say yes, especially if you got 240 volt. And what is it, like 40 to $60 for one of these versus 200 depending where you're from 150 to 300 if you're in Canada <laughs> for a normal PSU consumer grade ATX and yeah so they're definitely a lot cheaper they are efficient and if you got 240 volt then why not and as you can see there we have plenty of PCI cables for more cards we only used half of them this power that this, if this did have the power for it we could run all 12 of these cards easily but it doesn't so we don't <laughs> but if you had an 1800 watt 2400 watt easily no problem so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video there's 240 volt hp server power supply and this is my mining rig basement so catch you guys on the next one and wrap it out